Hey guys, we're Kerberos, and welcome back to my FIFA 17 Liverpool Crow mode. Sorry this video is going up a little late in the day. I had to record my other... So, because I found out that tomorrow the window officially opens. So, I had to get that video done today. So... I know, I could wait until the window was open, but... Hell, that video was already out of date. Not... It wasn't up a few hours, and it's already out of date. Why is it already out of date? Because I talked about how Liverpool pass... The, how Liverpool should be looking at... Maybe Ricardo Rodriguez as the left back. Oh, no way he's gone to... Who, who AC Milan for 18 million. We're here to describe the action for you. <clears throat> nice to have you with us. Martin Tyler here and Alan Smith. <laughs> Chelsea playing Liverpool with the great history of the fixture. Oh, football it makes me a head hurt sometimes. Been going for with just the, with the ghost goal at Anfield. between these two teams. This is the Liverpool Which is side. why I get starts in goal. Nathaniel Klein starts with David Alaba as the fullbacks. Hazard! Yeah. Great joy. And coming on to FIFA. Playing in Liverpool some team. games. The goals they've scored. And just relaxing. The in this division, they've been... The shot's on! Well, a corner to come because of that deflection. Rato Sanchez! Oh, Carius with the save. Palms it out for the corner. Come on, someone get the head on that. Sul! Oh, he hit the post! Dunny Ali! He'll score! Like most things he does, he's got an air of grace about him. Nicholas Saw hit the fucking post. What a moment that what a time that would have been to break his uh season duck. With the shot from Matt was blocked, it comes to hit the Ayali. I hit it first time and it goes in off the cr her. Whew! That has opened the score. Uh, can you imagine Nicolas Sewell picking now? Well, not picking, but scoring the first, his first goal of the season. He's the only outfield player with no goal in the Premier League this season. In the starting 11. And that is the closest he has gotten. almost. They saw it coming from a long way out. The timing was great, and the I mean, will he get closer than that this season? I don't know. I can't imagine how much closer. He, the only way he could have gotten closer without scoring is if the ball had been cleared off the line. I mean, by one of the defenders instead of hitting it off the post. That's the only way it could have been closer. Obviously, when I say it's cleared off the line, like it's, it's going to be an attacking move. Control. This from Chelsea. They've the coped anyway. well defensively. Had it. This is a, this is a fake Chelsea. There you go. Now I'm after. Chelsea have got possession. They're putting that far into my head. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Daniel Klein. With all the cards here, it seems. Roberto Especially Firmino. The points that they got for winning the away game on the ground of the opposition here. Well, if they play half as well as they did in that reverse game, I think they're going to coast to a win here. So we'll uh, collect that. 
Renato Sanchez. Renato Sanchez. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition. Divo Carigi. Some money to Reina. Scoring position here, not picked up, and they paid a heavy price for that. Right on the uh, half hour mark. For Liverpool, it is looking pretty much now that the victory is assured. Lovely fluid motion from San. Sanchez to Origi to Mane into the back of the net. Lovely. Liverpool really on top form in their first half. Roberto Firmino. He's coming forward with some danger. Firmino. And that will be a goal kick. Very, very I think it was Alonso who did enough. This touch map is uh, to cut out my attack. As to why his team are losing, he's not been able to lead from the front like usual. That's very really quick. Uh. Oh no, it was uh, Martinez. Hazard. He went in well. It's three. Javi Martinez. Liverpool will get the throw. That will go out for a throw. Right down um, close to my uh, goal. Let's uh, clear that. Lovely ball. Lovely ball. Rigi is going to get onto this. He has money in support. He won't use him and he doesn't need him. Four. Now, thank you for coming, Chelsea. You can go back now. You don't need to come out for the second half. Well, scoring in any game is worthy of celebration. When you get two, it is special. And he is feeling that special delight at the moment. 21 league goals for Origi. So they're looking for more at 4 0. Not exactly uh, saying the it's Premier League up here. On fire, but 20 goals in a season is nothing to be. He. Roberto Firmino. He. Origi. He's there. To the attacking third. Makes a challenge here. There's the half time whistle. Spurs are winning. Hmm. I was hoping that would not be. Really it was a very one sided first half, yes. and they team on the wrong end of that scoreline has got to show a bit of backbone now and in goes the cross and it's the goalkeeper's ball quite clearly a wasted cross Kane Chelsea on the attack and in goes the cross when that Nicholas, yes, thank you. Oh, never mind. Hey! That was a terrible attempt. Can I even call that an attempt? Feels like a, an insult to all strikers everywhere to call that. that. Whatever it was from the young Chelsea defender for an attempt. And that's deflected behind. It will be a corner. We'll see what the He's game plan scores goals. He makes goals. Is at the end of the game. Modern day attacker Sadio Mane. He's got stats. To find space within shooting distance, and he's done it really well today, and, and found the back of the net too. Time for the substitutes, I think, for Chelsea. Mashawai. I did. Could have the pace. Oh shit! I made a mistake. Not a great cross Nicholas cleans up a better than any janitor on the planet. Alan, what about Chelsea's next game? Oh wow! Well, they're playing Manchester United. More big games are coming. I'm playing Man City in the next game, and Chelsea 
or uh, and he's allowed uh, three substitutes and two being visited by here. the other side of Manchester, Manchester United. Strong, fair challenge, balls out for a throw though. Roberto Firmino. All we need is for Spurs to be playing someone like Arsenal and it would be like the super weekend of dreams. Firmino! Corner kick coming up. Rain with the tackle just at the crucial moment. Have a look at that, the corner count. Sul! Oh, I took a deflection off the soccer face. He goes out for another corner. I know it won't actually mean anything, but I would just like the stat of having every outfield player in the regular starting 11 having scored at least one Premier League goal during the season. After this I'll have eight games to get Nicholas Sewell a goal. If it comes down to it I'll give him a fucking penalty. See, that's how, how much I want it. Like I said it won't mean anything but I don't know. I've had seasons he went in well. where a few defenders, in fact I think I nearly scored with every outfielder in like a, with some danger to the opposition in like season 2 or 3 of this career mo but then, and I think it was only Nathaniel Klein who missed out which is weird considering he has scored this season and it's Sue who's uh Javi Martinez. Trying to switch on the. I think that might have been the second the situation. Kotoa has quick, or at least too quick for Martin has to almost time respond. What does this mean for their next game? Well, Liverpool go up against Manchester City. The way they've played out here today, they'll be full of confidence, I think. So. Thiago. Held off the defender with good touches here. Got the tackle in. Come on, Nicholas. Referee is pointed for a free kick here. Free kick is no good to me. The, uh, the pain to get the gain, and they've suffered these supporters sometimes, but. It's gain today, isn't it? Well, they've seen their team play well out there today. What was that, damn it? Before the ref has called the halt of proceedings. We're down now to the final two minutes of the 90. <sighs> well here. There's the ball in. Crossed over into the safety of Courtois' hands. No, uh, yeah. Gilfie Sigurdsson. Could be dangerous. Continue. Is there another goal in this game? Yes, there is. A little Brazilian, Felipe Coutinho. He's always got an eye for the main chance. Not sure how that went in. But, uh, I'll take it. Let's see the replay of this. And the goal looks spectacular. Comes in from the wing, avoids the challenge. Some power behind that effort. I think the crossbar. Oh, just went in off the crossbar. I thought it took. I thought it smashed carriers in the face and went in off the bar then. So it's gonna be Coutinho's goal. I thought for a second it was gonna be an own goal. 
don't know. Coutinho scores his eighth of the season. 5-0 and the game underway again. And he uh, finishes off Chelsea in style. Well, it turned out to be. I mean, what else is new? Spurs also won in style. 3 0 against West Bromwich Albion. Everton nil. Crystal Palace three, Aston Villa two. So I'm um, still 21 points. Chelsea nil. Clear with eight one. games remaining. City three, Tottenham Hotspur three, West Bromwich Albion. I'm um, 27 so points clear. Of Chelsea now. At the top of the table, which means that they can no longer catch me. Tottenham Hotspur with 67 points. In third, so Chelsea now it is officially in fourth, a two the table are full Pants horse race in the Premier League. Points. In fifth, League. rising up the table are Bournemouth with 43 points. In sixth and falling are Everton. And I can actually win the Premier League title right here right now I just need Spurs to drop points they don't have to lose they just need to drop points the question is if the game doesn't want to tell me who they're playing come on game you you gonna tell me who they're playing yeah check it out for myself let's see Tottenham Hotspurs are playing Let's see Stoke on the 18th That's the next game and we have the Premier League Spurs 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 Ah there they are they are playing Aston Villa So Aston Villa could crown me the Premier League champions 13th Hopefully I'll be unlucky for Spurs. And I will get a Premier League number four. Origi and me are a little tired, but I don't think they'd want to has possibly the match where we are crowned the Premier League champions. I would imagine not anyway. Besides the next game is the first game of the next episode is a uh, cup game, so they'll get their rest then. Is with me as always. We'll try not to make any slips in the commentary, but there might be some slips out on the pitch, Alan. Here we go. The Etihad. I don't think it's gonna during the course of the match. Is it where I will be crowned Premier League champion for the fourth consecutive for the players. Let's find out. Changes for Manchester City. Nicolas Otamendi plays with Vincent Company in central defense. Ideally, I want to get a nice early goal to set the pace. In the engine room, Sergio Aguero is the sole striker. And then put Spurs under immense pressure. David Alaba starts with Nathaniel Klein as the wide defenders. Remember, they all have to win. Sanchez in central. Deny me. Ivo Corigi starts. He's been in tremendous form recently. Crown. At least the issue really is for one more game, obviously. In this match. What a great chance for them. He's set up if I win the table at this stage in that game against Stoke, over the course that will be following the, the, more the, same now. the next the league game, I will win the Premier League anyway. And that's well, only if Spurs do indeed defeat Aston Villa. So, I mean, it's all in my hands. Those are pretty impressive stats.
It'll be another corner. Renato Sanchez! Oh! Douglas Costa. Gundogan. It's now with Liverpool. Tino will get it off him. Here we go. Flip Coutinho. Pulls it back. Diego Carrigi! Oh, yeah! His own player! He had his own teammate! Or wait, did it go off of company? Please tell me it went off of company. Oh, it did, thank goodness. Working hard Alex. just to see maybe a sight of goal. Money! Oh! Here's a chance, the goalkeeper exposed. Really? Gone for the through pass. Frick. Makes the challenge here. De Bruyne, Costa, Aguero. Back Give to the Bruyne. See, so you're playing some very nice football. Ball here from the first. First half. There's Costa. And it's now with Liverpool. Fairly challenged by Joel Matti. As was a uh, Dele Alli by short passes, but they're keeping the ball. To put them in front. Ooh, Guerrero probably should have scored there. Come on, win the header. Yes. Marini. There's some potential in this move. It could be a chance here for Liverpool. Gets it up. Continue. Oh my god, no! How did you miss that? The cherry on the icing on the cake. That would have been the perfect. He's missed it. Pick way. Missed a wonderful opportunity. The captain there. scoring the goal that could be for me the champions again, and he missed. I mean, somehow I missed. I have absolutely no idea how I missed that. Kyle Walker. Good challenge. Okay, He's got some ball here. Win it back. Good play, but they've lost the ball now. And the and the right. penalty. It. Here's Douglas Costa. <laughs> Dele Alli. Firmino. Firmino! Oh my God! The Brazilian can freaking put it in the back of the net. One Brazilian misses, and then the other Brazilian misses. It's not a good day to be a player from a South American continent. The he shot that should have all equal goals, all coming from players from that part of the world. The well, Guerrero could have an edge to it, isn't it? Because I know the home team are pretty upset with what happened in the away Argentina. game when they were beaten. Rigi was well, pleased about their performance or indeed the reception. I was going to say he was going to go and see if uh, a European would have better for luck. With, uh, he leaves in team seat, so it might be a closer one here. That's a wasted throw. He's in a good position. And the goalkeeper will get this one, no problem. to indicate three added minutes. Three minutes added time. Spotted that well and intercepted. Right. Much better. Send your money for the moment. No! Defend it. Got enough on it. Him in the side. Roberto Firmino. Shots blocked very quickly. It's half time. Of course, it's not going to show me the other games because they haven't started the yet, I guess. In the, second half. in the early game. The rain is still coming down and the pitch is getting wetter and wetter. Ah! Oh. Oh. That's out, this will be a throw. 
Fernando hit it off of David Debrana. Fino to go off of Kyle Walker. Costa. Uh, short cut pass. Messed up. So oh, oh, yeah, he's very soon for you. That's a foul. Yell card for Gundogan. He pleads for free, thank you. Oh, Manchester City. A little plot on their record today. A yellow card for their man. Yeah, I think he'll take that under the circumstances. And he the nearly! Oh! No scraps for the attackers to feed on from the goalkeeper that time. Hung on to the ball well. We've had eight shots. Six on target. For Liverpool. You know what I just realised? The game against Chelsea would have won me the league if I had beaten Spurs earlier in the season. Because if I had beaten them earlier in the season, they'd be two. He threw he points behind. You mean? Here's Douglas Costa. Sterling. Building steadily here. And I would only. I wouldn't be relying on the, him to drop points. And it's been assuming I win here. We've still got 30 more minutes to go and I'm sure we're gonna win. Which I'm gonna make sure of. And the way I'm gonna do that is I'm gonna bring on an Emre and Feyor for Firmino and Origi. They are too tired. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. And I don't want them pulling up with injury. On the front foot now, they've got. For me, I was last act will be winning it, a corner off of. Ari, and Ari, Ari now. Not sure how to say it. Left back's name. Money. Stopped by the goalkeeper, and he's hung on to the ball as well. A good control under pressure. Oh, this is, you know, I just got a weird feeling. This is like season one. How like is see how like season one is it? Emery Moore, no way, not again! Oh, can you imagine? Can you imagine? The man who scored the winning goal for the season one Premier League win. Can you imagine scoring the winning goal again? Of course, this one goal won't actually be the winner here against Man City because there will be time left in the game to pay. Before the cross could come Scored, of course. Zephyr had a good look at that decided it's just a throw after the tackle. So, lumps it forward and hit it too hard. He's read that, hasn't he? They are. Deception. Made it look easy, actually. Here's a chance oh. to attack. What about Liverpool's next game? Klein. Well, they're playing Bayern Munich. They the are. Match in the Champions Cup quarter More. final first leg. Money! Yes! Sonio! Money! The are going absolutely nuts. They can't believe it. It's not well, guaranteed, but that could be the goal that win the fourth Premier League title. They wouldn't be expecting to win the game. They were expected to be a very and difficult the match. And who, so, but who almost single-handedly won the first two. Actually better than this team, the you just who? who he would he'd have a hand in six. In the crowd, another one. His 19th goal of the season. He's in very fitting considering his number. To be catching with the Wonderful. Now, man, see. He sensed it was coming. It's finally. What is your answer? Attacking third. Of course, it's not guaranteed that will be the. This might be it. And the goalkeeper's out. That'll win me the Premier League. He's got to the ball at the feet of the forward. Yeah, a lot uh, to do with his good advantage. He puts Spurs under all the pressure. Slows down the space quickly. Now they have it. comes the support. Now they can go forward, having won the ball. Well, this is how this team can play. Sustained attacking football. But when they lose it, as they've done now, 
It's just a risk that they might get caught out. There's good progress with this attack. Still Matip says, no! Piling men and that's out for a goal kick. Oh, okay. He shits throwing. Everybody forward. Three minutes, that's what's going to be played for added. Ali. Renato Sanchez. Renato Sanchez. Here's Emery Moore. Emery Moore. It's a quick break. Pulls back. Oh, he took the shot and hit Struman. And there's the full time whistle. Simon Manny's goal is enough. But is it enough? Enough. It's enough. They had the ball, which wasn't that often. Um, I mean, the players aren't celebrating like they've won the Premier League title. The subs aren't running onto it. The they used it extremely well. That has happened before. To be fair, they, as far as I know, the Spurs game hasn't even kicked off yet. I have to wait until it loads and shows me that. I actually, I'll have to check the Premier League table because it's going to show me. The Champions Aston League, Villa, because two. that's my next Tottenham game. Hotspur, the game against Bayern. Chelsea, nil. Manchester United, one. Everton, three. Sunderland, one. Leicester City, three. Bournemouth, nil. Manchester City, nil. Liverpool, one. Stoke City, nil. Norwich City, two. Watford, two. Southampton, three. And let's take a look at what so those results mean to the final. table. Me versus Bayern, Dortmund, Real Madrid, Barcelona, Leverkusen, Tottenham Hotspur with 70 points. In third, Chelsea anyway. with 61 points. In fourth, climbing the table are Everton with 46 points. Wait, In fifth, moving down, the wrong Crystal way. Palace with 46 points, but only behind on goal difference. I mean, unintentionally building up more suspense. There we go. 45 points. In seventh and falling are. Oh fuck, I forgot the community shield! In eighth, moving down are Manchester City with 42. Ah, oh, they won. Bottom of the table, Watford they won. with 23 points. Damn it. There's still 21 points. Second bottom, West Brom but with 23. That means. Points, but only behind on goal difference. The next Third game. Bottom, Newcastle United with 24. I will points, with a win game in hand the next the league game. I will win Stoke City the Premier League points. trophy. Fifth ball, All I have Norwich to do City with 34 to points. Stoke. No easy task, but I didn't get into this position by doing things the easy way. Is that in the next episode? Please tell me it is. I don't care about the Argentinian League. Sorry about that. Come on. Calendar, it is. Look at that. Look at that weird third. Barn and then Stoke and then Barn and Stoke again. <laughs> that is crazy, crazy. He fixed their ah, fixture arranging there by FIFA 17. And before I'm gonna I end the episode, I'm just gonna select the team that will play the first leg against Bayern. Um. Do I want to go with this team, or do I want to go with this team? I think Cox still needs to play some games. He's played eight games. How many games do he need to play? I think, is it ten? Because then he would only need to play two more. And that'll work out perfectly. Yeah, 10. So he only needs to play two more games. If the thing wants to work. So, yeah, I'll use this team for the first leg. And I'll use this team for the second leg. 
and then this team can play again in the uh, FA Cup against Stoke. And uh, that's the best way to end the episode. Thanks for watching. I'm um, Joy. Smash the like button if you did. Subscribe if you're new. Do not miss the next episode where I, I will, will be crowned Premier League champion for the fourth time. Until then, thanks for watching. I'm Joy. And until next time, I hope you all have a very, very nice day.